गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल ऑफ यू माय सेल्फ दिनेश कुमार गुप्ता डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ केमिस्ट्री यूपी राष्ट्रीय टंडन ओपन यूनिवर्सिटी टुडे वी स्टार्ट बीएससी केमिस्ट्री यू जी सी एच ई वन जीरो वन कोर्स नेम इन ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री वन बेसिक इन ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री यूनिट टू केमिकल बॉन्डिंग मॉड्यूल टू केमिकल बॉन्डिंग इन मॉड्यूल वन वी हैव लर्न introduction objective of the unit 3 chemical bonding and ionic bonding in module 2 in this module we learn covalent bonding valence bond theory vbt and vesper theory and concept and in this unit we have two more module we discuss later where we discuss molecular orbital theory weak interaction hydrogen bonding metallic bonding introduction in this unit learner may learn how atoms are combined with each other how atom combine with each other how the atom combine combination takes place from to form one molecule learner may also come to know what type of properties may help the atoms to combine the other or same atoms what extent they may combine with other atoms learner also come to know what type of bonding takes place between atoms and how extend the theory applicable in the formation of molecules in this unit following objective will be fulfill types of bonding ionic bonds covalent bonds vbt mot hydrogen bonding metallic bonds covalent bonding covalent bonding in this module we will discuss Lewis G L Lewis was the first suggest in 1916 that atom combine with one other by sharing of electrons in their valence cell so the atom attain nearest noble gas configuration the shared electron combine towards stability of both atoms this type of linkage is called covalent linkage or covalent bond the compound formed by this mechanism are called covalent compounds for example scl and o2 this is the molecule of scl this is the molecule of o2 in scl one electron and here is seven electrons and this forms this type of electron sharing and form one covalent bond this is the shared electron bond and when six electron of one six electron of other oxygen atom combine and form this type of sharing where two two electrons of each oxygen atom form two covalent bond according to lewis concept number of electron which an atom combine for sharing in covalent bond is called covalency thus covalency of hydrogen chloride and oxygen is 1 1 and 2 respectively the covalency of hydrogen is 1 and covalency of chloride is 1 and where oxygen covalency is 2 here 1 and here 2 valence bond theory vbt valence cell electron pair repulsion vesper model is the structure where 
given atom is determined principally by minimizing electron pair repulsions the valence cell electron pair repulsion model predict the shape of molecules and ions by assuming that valence cell valence cell electron pairs valence cell means outermost cell of the atom or central atom are arranged as far from one another as possible to predict the relative position of atoms around given atom using the vesper model you first note that arrangement of the electron pair around the central atom the following rule and figure will help distinguish electron pair arrangements draw the lewis structure determine how many electron pair around the central atom count the multiple bonds as one pair arrange the electron pair are shown in table given below the direction in the shape of the bonding electron pair give the molecular geometry obtain the molecular geometry form directions of bonding pairs see in next slide here electron pairs 2 3 4 5 6 it is the molecule molecular electron pairs we have two electron pairs like this means two bonds it's form linear like this where three three electron pairs means trigonal trigonal means like this okay and we are tetrahedral like this we are five trigonal bipyramidal this like this this is trigonal bipyramidal and when six is octahedral it's octahedral this is the trigonal bipyramidal this octahedral forms like this this is the octahedral when six electron pairs will be present in a molecule and after this vesper theory and concept valence electron pair repulsion theory provide method for predicting shape of molecules based on electron pairs electrostatic repulsions it is described by a sedwick powell rule in 1940 and further developed by gillespie and norms 1957 in in spite of the method very simple approach based on lewis electron dot structure vesper method predict shape that compare favorably with those determined experimentally however this approach is the best provide approximate shape of the molecule not complete picture of bonding the most common method determine the actual x ray structure structure although electron diffraction neutron diffraction and many type of spectroscopy are also used to determine the structure of the molecule 
ever we will discuss some of the molecule molecular orbital arrangement for the shape of the simple molecule electron repel each other because they are negatively charged the quantum mechanical rule force some of them to be fairly close to each other in bonding pair or lone pair bonding pair and lone pairs but each pair repel all other pairs according to vesper model therefore molecule adopt geometry in which their valence electron pair position themselves as far as from each other as possible the molecule can describe by generic formula a x m e n where a is the central atom x stands for any other atom or group surrounding the central atom and e represent lone pairs of electrons the steric number m plus m where m number position occupied of atom lone pair around central atom lone pairs and bond pairs nearly equal to influence a molecular shape previously i told you when two electrons or where from vesper theory it gives linear structure where three is trigonal bipyramidal four tetrahedral trigonal bipyramidal trigonal octahedral and pentagonal bipyramidal these are vesper geometries for 2 to 16 electron pairs the basic principles of the model are as follows valence electron pair around atom where bonding and non bonding adopts a geometry of maximized distance between the atom the basic geometry is usually observed with 2 to 7 pair as shown in figure given above a previous slide no bonding electron pair are closer to central atom than bonding pairs and have larger repulsion in fact the order of interaction is when two non bonding pairs is there so interaction is maximum and where bonding bonding two pairs are there interaction is minimum and when non bonding electron and bond bonding electron the interaction is in between the non bonding bonding in repulsion and bonding bonding repulsion if the double bond or triple bond are present the four or six electron involved behave as if they were single pair although they exert more repulsion than do the two electron of a single bond as the terminal atom become some more electronegative relative to the central atom bonding electron pair are drawn away from the central atom and so repel less drawing the valence structure including non bonding pairs on the central atom then gives the total number of pairs or multiple bonds counted as single pair 
this is sometime is called steric number of the central atom the equal of the number n of bonded atoms plus the number of non bonding electron pair it is the steric number see here is steric number 224 when bonding non bonding electrons number is 2 or 4 the shape of shown in figure are simple and the rule generally easy to apply without non bonding electron r linear species where steric number is 2 these are the some examples beryllium hydride mercury chloride carbon dioxide and ions isoelectronic in two such no2 plus n3 minus and cno minus and trigonal planar structure where steric number is 3 it is the trigonal planar it is the trigonal planar yeah this the trigonal planar where b b f3 carbon co3 2 minus and NO3 minus. These give the trigonal planar species. Tetrahedral species where steric number is four. This forms methane CH4, silconium chloride, SiCl4, PuCl3, and SO4 minus minus. in ax2 species where steric number is 3 or 4 are bent this ax2 the steric number is 3 or 4 are bent structure which the molecular bonding pair occupy position of trigonal planar or tetrahedral respectively example are water molecule s2 water molecule as pre predicted by rule 2 and 4 xax bond angle are less than the ideal value 120 of steric number 3 or 109.5 degree of steric number 4 it is the ideal bond angle between bond pair and lone pair when maximum expansion takes place during the Uh, formation of uh, uh, maximum expansion between or interaction of bonds tend to decrease the electronegativity difference ax increases some example with their bond angle when steric number 3 no2 minus is 100 Fifteen degree and chlorine ClNO bond angle is one thirteen. When steric number is four, this angle become one hundred four point five degree and S two S this angle decreases more ninety two degree and F two O this degree this ideal. steric number 4 the 102 degree in ax2 the where steric number 
द नॉन बॉन्डिंग पेयर फोर्स ऑ द बॉन्ड टू द पेरामिडल इन अमोनिया एंड वेयर स्टेरिक नंबर फोर एस एन फाइव द नॉर्मल शेप ऑफ एडॉप्टेड बाय फाइव ग्रुप इज द ट्राइगोनल बाय पिरामिडल दिस स्ट्रक्चर एज पी एफ फाइव देयर आर नॉट टू इन इक्वेलेंट टाइप ऑफ पॉजिशन टू एक्सीयल एंड थ्री इक्वटोरियल टू एक्सीयल एंड थ्री इक्वटोरियल इट एपियर्स दैट इक्वेटोरियल पोजिशन अलाउ मोर स्पेस दैन एक्सीयल वंस दस बल्कियर ग्रुप्स लाइक क्लोरिन इन पी एफ फोर सी एल टेन टू फाउंड इन दिस पोजिशन एज डू नॉन बॉन्डिंग पेयर्स वेन दीज आर प्रेजेंट दिस सक्सेसिवली वन टू एंड थ्री नॉन बॉन्डिंग पेयर्स द मोलिकुलर शेप आर एज फॉलोज ए एक्स फोर इज ऑफ्टन डिस्क्राइब a seesaw with two axial and two equatorial x position the former being slightly be bent out of the ideal linear configuration by the lone pair repulsion for example sf4 3 xco2 f2 where oxygen in preference to fluoride occupy the equatorial position see the rule 3 ax3 gives t shape as in chlorine trifluoride ax2 linear as bonded atom are axial example xcf2 in coordination number or steric number 5 and i3 minus give the linear structure steric number 6 basic shape of octahedral found sf6 p f6 minus all position are equivalent to with one non bonding pairs sf a x5 adopt square pyramidal structure for example Br F five and X C O four. These give a square pyramidal structure. The square pyramidal is this. Where repulsion between the double bond, where double bond and the lone pair is minimized by putting these trans to each other. when two non bonding pairs are present they minimize the repulsion it is the rule one rule two by adopting the trans configuration giving the square planar molecule xcf4 and icl4 minus steric number 7 the only simple example pentagonal bipyramidal structure it is the ideal for if7 and the ion xcf5 minus 
विच पेंटागोनल प्लेनर हैविंग टू लोन पेयर ऑक्यूपाइंग द एक्सीएल पोजिशन फॉर एक्सी एफ सिक्स दिस पिक्चर यू गिव यू कम टू नो अबाउट दिस थ्योरी अप्लाइड टू द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द गिवेन फॉर्मूलाज इन ए स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द मॉलिक्यूल वे आर स्टेरिक नंबर इज टू यस स्टेरिक नंबर इज टू बी सी एल टू बी सी एल टू इट इज बी वेन स्टेरिक नंबर थ्री बी एफ थ्री एंड एस एन सी एल टू सी दिस एंगल डिक्रीजेज वेन दिस लोन पेयर इज प्रेजेंट एंड वेन स्टेरिक नंबर इज फोर this is 109 degree and when lone pair is present in ns3 this angle decreases to 106 and where when in s2 molecule where two lone pair are present this angle decreases much more and give the bent structure and when steric number is 5 this is the pcl 5 and when we see sf4 this lone pair decrease this degree and it form trigonal this is the trigonal bipyramidal this is the trigonal planar so oh, oh, tri trigonal bipyramidal this is trigonal pyramidal and when b f 3 we have 5 1 2 3 4 5 5 is the steric number and there are two lone pair then it gives this type of structure b f 3 and where when xylin f2 it gives linear structure and when steric number is 6 sf6 it is sf6 and when iodide if 5 the bond angle decreases and when xcf4 it is the square planar sp okay and this give the this structure okay we move next extension difficulties and exceptions one of the problem with vesper theory is that the rule appears somewhat arbitrarily and hard to justify in in a precise quantum mechanical formulation the interpretation of small variation in bond angle is often considered to be particularly uncertain in spite of this some model is surprising useful although discussion has concentrated on cases where single atom are bonded to a central atom vesper should be able to predict some geometries around any atom in a complex model molecule where main group atom are involved for example hydroxylamine ns2oh the bond around the nitrogen are pyramidal those around the oxygen bent as expected okay and here 
when multiple bonds the vesper model considered double bond triple bond we are double bond or triple bond having slightly greater repulsive effect than single bond because repulsive effect of an electrons for example cs3 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 c cs3 angle in cs3 2c double bond cs2 is smaller and cs3 c c cs double bond cs2 angle larger than trigonal 120 degree here some compounds are given methane the bond angle is 109 degree point 5 the carbon 4 bonded repulsion tetrahedral structure molecular shape tetrahedral water bent oxygen two bonded pairs two on shared pair tetrahedral bent structure this is the structure of water molecule this is methane ammonia where one lone pair unshared pair three bond pair the tetrahedral structure arrangement of electron pair the molecular shape would be trigonal pyramidal bf4 boron trifluoride there are three bonded pairs trigonal planar this is the trigonal planar structure formaldehyde cs2co this is the cs2co the carbon has two bond pair and one double bonded oxygen trigonal planar this also are three 1 2 3 structure and it form trigonal and co2 it is the linear structure where two double bond which counted two bonded pair gives linear structure once more steric number is 2 then carbon dioxide steric number 3 cof2 this is for no2 minus so3 this is for sf3n this is for s2cl2 this is for xco3 so4 minus minus when steric number is 5 this is sf4 oxygen this is for clo2 f3 and this is for xco3 f2 and when steric number 6 i f5 o okay these are the number of bond and multiple bond character hybridization of atomic orbitals vbt valence bond theory covalent bonding in result the overlap of atomic orbital having unpaired electron thus atom according to this theory be b and carbon which have re respectively 0 1 2 unpaired electron in their valence cell should be expected to form no covalent bond no covalent bond two covalent bond one covalent bond and two covalent bond but experimentally shows beryllium boron and carbon to form two divalency three trivalency and four tetravalency covalent bond respectively vbt says these element show divalency trivalency tetravalency one of the paired s2 electron is promoted to vacant p orbital and promotion of 2s electron to 
2p level require some energy which is available from heat of reaction taking place when covalent bond form provide no chance of principal quantum number during the promotion of electron thus beryllium boron carbon promotion of s2 2 sp orbital and give 3 2 4 unpaired electron respectively when hybridization takes place hybrid orbital each hybrid shape the figure here shown all the resulting hybrid combination omitting the smaller lobe in sp3 and higher orbitals here the theory of hybridization is given vbt s and p these are the s and p orbital they combine to form hybrid orbital of sp hybrid orbital and this give uh, molecule molecular structure linear and when s p and p orbital combine and they give sp2 hybrid orbital it is the trigonal structure and when tetrahedral where s and 3p combines it gives four hybrid orbital this give tetragonal structure and when s 3p and d orbital combine and it give five dsp3 hybrid orbital and this give trigonal bipyramidal structure and when s 3p and 2d orbital combines it forms octahedral structure coordination number Hy some hybridization are given in the table given below coordination number 2 it hybridization is sp the shape is linear and when hybridization may be pd and sd also then we also have shape linear sd angular and when coordination number 3 the hybridization trigonal bipyramidal for sp2 and p2d and asymmetrical planar structure spd and trigonal pyramidal pd2 also and when coordination number 4 tetrahedral structure the hybridization should be sp3 or sd3 and irregular tetrahedral structure the hybridization where should be spd2 or pd3d or pd3 uh, when square planar p p2 d2 sp2 and d then the square planar structure is confirmed when coordination number is 5 trigonal bipyramidal sp3 d or sp d3 hybridization in a molecule when tetragonal bipyramidal sp2 d2 and sd4 and pd4 and p3 d2 these are the hybridization found in the molecule when coordination number is 6 pentagonal bipyramidal the hybridization is p2 d3 and octahedral sp3 d2 and trigonal prismatic is sp d4 and pd5 these are the hybridization of different molecule this is very important for numericals where you want to find hybridization of a molecule like s2o s2o molecule in oxygen which hybridization takes place okay
thank you and further query you can contact with our email and mobile numbers thank you